Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about another problem that we got from Singapore Mass Olympiad 2013. In this problem, we have an expression and we need to evaluate it. The expression that we have is power of 6 of 3 plus square t of 17 over 2 and we need to find this value and then apply floor function on top of it. Obviously, we are not allowed to use any calculator. Before moving forward to talk about the solution, make sure that you pause the video to think about the problem. To be able to solve this problem, we are going to use a new notation. Let's start with using x for 3 plus square t of 17 over 2 and y for 3 plus minus a square t of 17 over 2. We are going to find out that x plus y is going to be 3 and x times y is going to be minus 2. Based on this new notation, we need to find floor of x to the power of 6. So let's start by calculating x to the power of 6 plus y to the power of 6. We can use an identity to simplify this expression and write it based on two terms. The first term is going to be x squared plus y squared and the second term is going to be power of 4 of x minus x squared y squared plus power of 4 of y. Now for the first term we can simplify it further. Remember x squared plus y squared is equal to x plus y squared minus 2 times xy. As for the second term, we can write it as x squared plus y squared to the power of 2 minus 2xy to the power of 2. Now let's put everything together. We can write x to the power of 6 plus y to the power of 6 based on just x plus y and x times y. If we replace the values, we will have 2041 for x to the power of 6 plus y to the power of 6. Now we have x to the power of 6 plus y to the power of 6. But we need to find the value that we have just for x to the power of 6. So we can write x to the power of 6 is equal to 2041 minus y to the power of 6. Remember, we needed to apply this floor operator on x to the power of 6. If we do that, then we will have floor of x to the power of 6 is equal to floor of 2041 minus y to the power of 6. We can show that y to the power of 6 is between 0 and 1. The reason is actually simple. We can show that y is less than 0 but greater than minus 1. So if we use power of 6 of y, then it's going to be a positive number, but less than 1. At the end, we have floor of x to the power of 6 is equal to floor of 2041 minus a small number. The value that we have for this small number is less than 1 and greater than 0. In this case, the value that we get from this floor operator is just 2040, and that's our answer. To wrap up, let's talk about what we've done to solve this problem. We wanted to calculate an expression. This expression has 3 plus square t of 17 over 2. We use x for this, and to be able to simplify it, we define a new notation for 3 minus square t of 17 over 2. We name it y. In the next step, we saw that x plus y and x times y are going to be two integers. We use these two integers to calculate the expression that we have here. At the end, we wanted to apply the floor operator. We saw that for a positive integer n and a positive real number like p less than 1, we can write floor of n minus p as n minus 1. We use this property to simplify the final expression and then we found the answer. Thanks for watching the video. If you would like to see more puzzles and mass involved activities, please subscribe to the channel.